Hey there, this is uh, Brad from Brad Tech Online, and I am uh, taking Panda Cloud Antivirus Beta for a test drive here. Um, uses a cloud based signature detection system where instead of uh, the traditional uh, downloading signatures, it queries a cloud for uh, which is a kind of a central repository on the internet where uh, it queries for information. Okay, I'm going to pull my uh, list up here that I've been testing all the other products with. I've seen some reviews on this product and they weren't very good, so we'll see how it does against you know my list here of 10, uh, 10 new threats that have came out today that I've found. It's already neutralizing something. Okay. Maybe stuff left behind. Well, I think it found that. It didn't tell me anything, though. Okay. Looks like it. F found classify this into the others and neutralized it and let's try this variant maybe detected it I don't know it's not really telling me anything there we go Three for three. Not letting me run the actual program, but I'm. Only thing that's uh, actually been very good and hasn't. Uh oh. There's that bad boy. Avaris Pro 2010. Making Panda sad panda. I should have a little sad face down there. Because it just got destroyed. Yeah. Now, now I'm starting to see why all the other reviews sucked for it. <laughs> well, it looks like something else also got two things are running. This fake security center. This is uh, part of Antivirus Pro 2010. There was a little fake security window center. It looks just like it. I was telling some of my friends at work about it. And... Should just stop the review right here, but I'm gonna go ahead and uh it's not even halfway through and it's already getting reamed here. Uh zero day stuff. Amazing for something that's actually cloud based to suck this bad. Ah, it's already installed. Same thing. We're not even to the Mac Daddy down here. This multi paratite uh, file that has about 20 different fake antivirus products. Maybe it's going ahead and cleaning some of the stuff up, but. Yeah. It was good that I detected that. Yes, please protect me. Looks like this tricked. Ooh, this looks like an interesting product. Please give it to me. I will give you my master cards. Yeah, this didn't happen a while ago on any of the other products. Even AVG, I think. Okay, yeah. 
Okay, so we got all this stuff running. I'm going to go ahead and let Panda, which has failed thus far, I'm going to let it do a uh, scan of itself. And po Holy moly. Okay. Estate programma. I'm going to let it do a scan here. And, uh... Antivirus Pro 2010, which is a fake antivirus. Uh, please protect me. I'll let you see right here. It'll take redirect you and want you to buy their product. I think it's actually broke. No. Okay. Go ahead and let's see what happens here. See if Panda finds anything else on the hard drive. Okay, 44 objects got by, which is uh, the worst so far, aside from uh, AVG, which got disabled, and 757 got by. I had to give Panda a 2 out of 5, or 1.5 out of out of 5. Uh, it's not really impressed with it so far. Um, it is a beta, so they got a long ways to go. Um, back in 03 and 04... You know, Panda was, uh, uh, her, had a Panda fanboy guy I worked with up in Chickasha, Oklahoma. Uh, so, uh, anyhow, this was okay, but probably the worst aside from AVG I've reviewed today. I would not uh, recommend it, and I think there's better out there.